What's up, you guys? Simwolf Hero here today. We are here at my apartment today. Uh, I'm gonna give you guys a nice little uh, room tour or uh, apartment tour. Uh, as you guys can see, this is what the YouTube money pays for. Uh, in my nice uh, decrepit uh, kitchen. Uh, my nice uh, living room complete with mouse hole. Um, I do have an extra bedroom though, so I mean if anyone wants to come and stay over and um, help me pay rent, uh, I don't mind the clothes on the floor, that was from the previous tenant. Um, also yeah, I have an electrical box in my house uh, that I have to work on and uh, uh, this is the, the, the extra bathroom, uh, those are some copper, copper fittings and uh, some stuff, so yeah, just, just watch your head uh, on those when uh, yeah, not in use. Um, it, 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 it's it's a, it's a nice place to live and oh there's another mouse hole uh, this is my room um, please don't come in here uh, it, it's it's the only nice room in the house actually um, but, but but I got a balcony that, that looks over the, the city you know what this house needs a remodel What's up, you guys? Simple Hero here today. Um, today, we are actually doing uh, a remodel. We're doing the remodel of uh, 19 Culpepper House, uh, and that is going to be in the Culpepper Apartments. Um, this is one of the apartments that came in with the City Living Expansion Pack. I didn't really cover the City Living Expansion Pack too much when it came out, unfortunately, due to, uh, unknown reasons, which I would not get into. Um, but I was not able to cover, uh, a City Living too much, so instead what I wanted to do is, um, I wanted to take one of the starter apartments and I wanted to make it, uh, my own, essentially. Um... So what I went ahead and did is I went ahead and uh, made six different rooms. Um, two of those are bathrooms, two of those are bedrooms. One of them is gonna be um, a kitchen slash living room and then obviously there's gonna be a balcony. Um, those six rooms are on the gallery so you guys can definitely go ahead and download them. I will leave all six uh, links to each of the rooms in the description box down below um as with any sort of room build um unfortunately the the city living expansion pack has its limitations when it re when it comes to um the actual whole um apartment unfortunately we can't upload the full apartment onto the gallery unless there's some sort of magical way of doing it and i'm just not aware of it yet so if you guys know if, uh, of any way to actually upload uh, apartments to uh, the gallery without actually having to like do it in a penthouse or anything like that uh, I, I, I don't even know if penthouses can do that uh, but if you guys know of any other way please let me know uh, comment section down below if, if you guys know of any sort of tricky tricky sneaky sneaky way of doing it yeah, but sneaky sneaky it's a, it's a backer with a vengeance and the sneaky sneaky mustache troll and everything um, but yeah what I wanted to do is I wanted to get uh, an apartment and because I am still in the process of uh, looking apartments, uh, figuring out what, what I'm personally going to do with my own life. I need to get it to get it together, man. I'm 22, almost 23, and you know, still living at home. So I, 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 I need to get my act together. I need to get my stuff together. Uh, but anyways, um, that that's what's kind of caught me in the mood for uh, doing a remodel. So I got one of the dingiest looking houses on the block. One of the dingiest apartments, I should say. And uh, I remodeled it in kind of a modern style. Um, what I went ahead and did with this is I actually uh, made two sims. Um, one of them is kind of the artsy type, uh, very creative, uh, kind of like me in some aspects. Um, and he's kind of over the top. And then we also had uh, his roommate that he met on Craigslist, of course. Um, but his roommate is actually more of the political type. He he loves wealth. He, he loves that kind of stuff. But unfortunately, he got kicked out by his family um, for doing some shady, shady stuff. Uh, and now he had to find a friend on Craigslist. And unfortunately, he's been rude to everyone he's ever met. 
that none of his friends actually want to room with him. So that's the story on the other guy. Um, and so he has his own separate bedroom uh, that kind of fits more of his style. The bedrooms are styled um, kind of for both of the guys individually. Um, one is kind of be kind of be more modern, uh, while the other one is gonna have more of a boho kind of flavor. Um, if you guys saw my uh, upload that I did was Simproved uh, w for the Boho uh, movie uh, lot, um, the ca Boho Cafe, I'm sorry. Um, it's going to be kind of in that summer style. Uh, if you guys want to watch that video of how we style the Boho Cafe, uh, there will be a card up above. Uh, so you guys can go ahead and click on that if you want to go ahead and watch that. Uh, me from the future, please make sure that I do that. Thank you. Um, so that's kind of the style of one of the rooms. The other one is going to be more of a modern kind of feel to it. It's very nice and clean. Um, so we went ahead and did that. Um, both of the rooms have um, bathroom extensions. So they won't have to bother each other. The only difference is with the um, bathroom that is right by the front door. That's going to be the guest bathroom that anyone can use. But it also has a door that leads into the other bedroom. So it's an ensuite as well. It's very interesting layout of the house, but I really do enjoy it. As you guys can already see, I've laid out the uh, wallpaper for the house, the, the flooring textures, and also, of course, uh, laid down some brick. Because if you live in an apartment, you have to have brick. That's the law. That 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 is the law from from the mouth of Tumblr. So that's what we did. <laughs> um, yeah. So. The, the whole city living expansion pack came out with a couple of other things and like I said since we didn't cover it too much That's kind of why I want to do the remodel um, Kind of in a style that I would definitely want for myself if you guys seen any of the bigger youtubers I suppose yeah, it's kind of similar to what the, the style that they like I guess um, But for me, it, I have more of an artsy kind of aspect with things and a lot more of a modern kind of feel I love modern stuff. I really do. It's one of my favorite things um, but yeah, we went ahead and put the curved TV and of course the nice uh, fireplace on there. I was trying to put the gnome from Guardians of the Galaxy somewhere, but unfortunately I was not able to put that there. Um, but I, I don't know, the, the, this living area especially came, was like one of my favorites that I've ever done. It, it, it gives enough space to the apartment. Uh, without going going too overboard, um, the apartment honestly is just the the kitchen and the living room in the main area, and then everything else is just kind of there. Uh, it, it's really cool. I really do like how this um, how the apartment came out. It looks really really uh, nice and interesting. I, I would definitely live in a place like this. It, it's it's just really really fun. I really enjoy it. I'm putting those uh, circle rugs down um, just to kind of give a, a different kind of flavor to the apartment just in general um, I wanted to do something like this um, instead of um, uh, the, the rugs uh, just putting like two rugs down just because I think the, it, it just gives it kind of a better flow of the house look at me like I know how architecture and interior design works but it, it, it to, to an extent it does um, so I, I really did enjoy it at one point I think I was gonna put one of those curved uh, um, sofas from uh, dying out in there but unfortunately was not working the way I wanted to so unfortunately I did not do that but instead I went ahead and did one of the modern kind of uh, things the, the way that I think about this is uh, some of the modern stuff uh, came from um, the very snob roommate uh, but some of the more artsy stuff like the posters and those uh, paintings and uh, a couple of the more artistic things um, came from the artsy sim so that's the kind of the way I brought it in um, they left them with a couple things and you know go going by that um, the way that I kind of planned this whole um, apartment was I wanted to keep the walls the same for the most part um, if you guys don't know, apartments in in the United States for for viewers who view this uh, anywhere else in the world, uh, apartments in the United States are a, you're able to decorate to a certain extent. Um, you're also able to paint in mo in most apartments. 
uh, if you want to have a different color on your walls, you can definitely do that in most apartments. Um, you just got to make sure that before you're um, before you're evicted or before you have to leave your apartments permanently, uh, that you have to um, change those colors back to what they were previously. So that's kind of one of the things with it. If not, you would pay up the butt to um, get that corrected, unfortunately, uh, which comes out of your deposit. You won't get that back. Um, so I kind of went off by those rules. And if they if these guys ever do get to successful careers, they just got to make sure to, to put everything back the way it was. Yeah. Um, yeah. Um, while I was making this house, actually, there was um, an issue with um, with my computer um, that I did a, a whole bunch of work. Actually, I got three rooms done and then my computer crashed. And guess what I forgot to do? Yep. I forgot to save. <laughs> um, I don't know why I forgot to save. I tend to save a lot when it comes to this game. That's why you guys see so many more um, um, cuts in between sometimes because that's me saving. Um, but I don't know. For whatever reason, it didn't work this time. Um, or I, actually, I just, just forgot to do it. So uh, I made sure to I save a lot the second time around. What I went ahead and did is I actually uh, had the recordings of what I recent of what I just did. And I went back and I built the apartment up from scratch again, pretty much the same exact way that I had it before. And I used the previous videos to tell me how I did it exactly. So um, it was good. I, I, I'm very happy that I got it done uh, the same way that I did it previously because I, I, I don't know. You forget sometimes what you do. So, but everything is exactly the same way that I had it before. Um, and, and it just looks great. I really do enjoy uh, how the the apartment looks in general. This is the nice modern bedroom for our politician slash architecture, I guess, is also another thing that I love to label him as. Um, this guy is essentially me, except without the money. That, <laughs> that, that That's me, essentially. But he's got a nice kind of modern kind of bedroom. I love the fact that I gave him like four of those placard jerseys up there. It's kind of some of those his prized possessions. Also, I gave him the golden talking toilet. Um, I, I actually gave that in the other b uh, bathroom as well. So it's kind of like a a, um, a standard, and that's why they're paying a little bit more. So quotation marks. Um, so that's how I, I kind of worked around that. Um, gave him an extra bathroom off to the side. Um, really nice, simple kind of bathroom. Um, gold and white and black accents for this bathroom i love those kind of color combinations the gold the white and the um black it, it, it's an interesting combination it's kind of a, like an old-timey combination but it works really well um and i just love those bricks that i used up against this house it looks really nice uh, like I said guys um, all of these rooms are up for download as I did mention before uh, City Living does have its limitations when it comes to um, apartments that you can't uh, upload the full apartment to the gallery unfortunately so what I had to do was I had to separate them off into specific rooms so that's what happened with that um, all the links for all of the bedroom all of the rooms are gonna be in the description box below uh, you guys can definitely go ahead and check out the gallery um, using my origin ID which is B O T E O J 21 which is my last name the first letter of my first name and then of course my favorite number which is 21 and then uh, you guys can also use hashtag sim wolf hero uh, hashtag remodel Hashtag Culpepper House. Uh, actually, no, just hashtag Culpepper. Uh, and you guys should be able to find it um, on there. Or you guys can just follow the direct links in the description box below. I put those in pretty much every single one of my um, room videos just so you guys be able to download that off of um, the actual gallery internet page instead of doing it in game if you find that easier. So, two ways of doing it for you. Um, yeah. So, here we are in the art artsy yeah that's a word the artsy sims room um his is more of a boho style more of a scattered cluttered things it, essentially the way that i thought of him was he's the artistic sim uh, he has all the um extra style stuff 
but he doesn't have a lot of money so the way that I thought about it is he got a lot of his stuff uh, used off of uh, Craigslist where he met his roommates of course uh, but he also got a lot of these things from rummaging around town um, and that's how I kind of thought of it so I, I think it's a it's a cool room overall um, there's a couple graffiti things that he made um, and things like that which he has to wash off before he ever leaves this place which at this point I don't think I would ever want to leave this uh, apartment it's just so cool I don't know it's very very nice and I really enjoy it uh, the rugs that came with city living my god the rugs that came with city living oh my god I love the rugs that came with city living have, have I said how much I love this expansion pack yet have I have I, have I stated that fact at all um, because I ha if, if I haven't, I'll say it again, I love this expansion pack. It's, it's my favorite thing. Uh, right behind um, right behind um, the Sims 2 open for business and right behind Sims 3 uh, university life, anything having to involve apartments or anything like that is one of my favorite expansion packs. So um, that's why um, Sims 3... Um, Oh my gosh, I'm forgetting the name already. Um, the, the Sims 3 expansion for um, uh, apartments and stuff was one of my favorite. I, I'm honestly forgetting the name of an expansion. What? No, let, let, me, let me do this right. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Wait a minute. Put a little love in it. Da -da -da -da. Um, late night. God, how, 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 do, how do I forget that? Uh, so Sims 2 Late Light and uh, Sims 3 Late Night were uh, one of my favorite expansions just because we were able to use the capability of making apartments. Fortunately, the apartments have a little bit more limitations in uh, the Sims 4 iteration of the game. Um, I wish that they didn't have that much limitations. Um, but unfortunately, we, we get what we get, and, and for the most part, I'm very happy with how it is. So it's very great uh, of course we do a balcony here for um the artsy sim a lot more boho style so he gets the the nice ensuite bathroom to never be disturbed but he also gets a nice um a nice uh, balcony the way that i thought about it is how how they would divvy up the rent is um the artsy sim would pay more because he, he actually has a job. Uh, he actually has a part-time job as, um, as a barista, uh, which if you guys don't know what that is, that is a coffee maker at a, a coffee shop. Um, he has a part-time jit there, but he also sell, he sells his paintings and he also does gigs with piano and guitar. So he's the artsy sim. So he, he clambers for money like no none other uh and then I, that's that's the way i divvied up the rent so he gets the bigger room he gets the ensuite bathroom and he gets the balcony and then the other sim gets what he gets because he actually is in the po political uh background right now but he's working as an intern so it, his family had the poli uh, had good political power and they had um, a, a way to actually get him an in, but unfortunately, since he was just a jerk to everyone, uh, his family was like, nope, you have to do it on your own. Uh, get out of our house, please. And that's the way I kind of did it. So that's the story I go along with it. So it's very good. Yeah, very, I'm very happy. Anyways, we're finishing off the, the ensuite bathroom here. You're just putting a last couple of rugs in here. Um, just making making everything look nice and pretty it's it's one of my favorite pastimes make everything nice and pretty anyways guys uh i leave you here with the before and after pictures look how hideous the uh this place was before and look at it how pretty is is after i, re I really enjoy the the before and after shots it's it's one of my favorite things that i that i've done for this uh for this video uh here's a before shot of um, the guest bedroom uh as you can see kind of plain and here is the after shot of the bedroom as it is now a lot more green a lot more lush uh it looks very nice um so i'm very enjoying it here is the guest bathroom that's off to the side as you can see i added a wall there to go ahead and cover up those copper pipings uh because there was no way of actually deleting them of course the other bedroom as well Anyways, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys liked it, leave a like and then, um, 
down below leave a comment letting me know what you guys enjoyed about this house really would appreciate that uh, description box you'll find the links for all the rooms here if not you can go ahead and use the hashtag symbol of hero or uh, B-O-T-E-O-J-21 I will see you guys in the next one bye guys